Hello and welcome back to Cassette Beasts. Now last time we discovered something pretty interesting about Kaylee. It's been implied that she used to be one of the cultists up at Autumn Hill. And I think it's only fitting that we go and check out what that's all about, because yes, that is where we left off last time. Pretty cool that we can just fast travel to this station, that will become very useful later. We have a rogue fusion. Is this two fusion monsters? Double Dandelion and Blossomore? Right. Okay, we're going to start off with a Zephyr on the Double Dandelion. And I'm going to use a call for help. Uprooted, good. Nice, I got my own whatever that is. I, I think that's a Dandelion. Okay, we're going to focus all fire on Double Dandelion. And when I can, I'm going to use a Sonic Boom. Oh, I'm leeched. Not a good sign. Being leeched heals both of my opponents. That's unfair. I like the fact that they both went for the dandelion, though. Yep, gonna continue smacking the double dandelion. Nice. Ooh, okay. Okay, so the blossom ore is actually not fused. Because, yes, I can capture it. I got suspicious when it took a lot of damage from that Sonic Boom. So I'm going to try to catch the Blossomore and I'm going to use Sonic Boom as well. Ooh, that's not a high chance. Up to 48. Yes, continue to smack the Dandelion. Thank you very much. You're going to take another hit, which should increase the chance again. Only to 50, though. We got him. Dandelions that enter a long hibernation period are said to emerge as elegant blossomore, so it's Dandelion's evolution. Okay, it's quite defensive, and its ranged attack is okay. It's not the most impressive monster I've ever seen. However, that's fine, because that's just adding to our cassette decks. Okay, we're gonna hit... Oh, I just made them fuse. I didn't mean to. I hate that the button... Right, I need to remember this. I hate that the button is one left press away from the start of the menu. Because that's where I want record to be. That is a crazy design. Well, you know what? We're just going to Sonic Boom. Ooh. Oh, no, I'm asleep. I have Sleep Talk. A power of 120, but an accuracy of 1. Same with Sleepwalk, but it's melee. Calls for help from the Astral Plane. We're going to try and summon Tulpa. No. That was a 1 in 100 chance then. Ooh, that could be bad. Let's use a Sonic Boom and win the fight. Another 500 XP. Thank you very much. And a Fused Metal. Yep, that's actually fine, because, you know what, we can just catch Dandelion at another time. Oh, the game crashed. Okay, let's see, where did it put me? Right, so it did just skip the fight, and yes. Sadly, I don't have that anymore. There is a bootleg on the screen, so I do still get something cool, but I am quite annoyed that the game crashed then, because that was a fun fight. Nice. Okay, we got the bootleg domino off at least. Okay, and I'm going to attempt to catch the dandelion. Good stuff. Good stuff. Let's head on in to this tunnel. Okay, how are we doing this? Ah, right. Okay, I think I've got it. I think I did a cool thing. Ooh, okay. That could be really good. 70% chance to be, well, not confused. Got a tape back, and we got 50 wood. And then now, presumably, yes, look! Okay, we have access to the rest of Autumn Hill. And what looks to be a cultist. Hey. Stop! I can sense the pain within you, my friend. You suffer because you desire to be home. Yeah, I mean, he's not wrong. Allow me to end your pain. Become our tribute to the angels. 
Right. I choose no. Ooh, a thwackalope. Yes, we know thwackalope very well. That's a lovely smack. There we go. Over nice and quickly. See you later. Unless he has two. Which he does. Ooh, a wing gloom. Nice. Now then, if I use an air attack on that electric type, it's going to give it multi-attack. So I think think I'm going to use Sprint, and we're going to use Dodge as well. Thunder Blast. Oof. Electrified. In New World, air conducts electricity abnormally well, leaving air-type targets weak to future lightning-type attacks. Right, conductive characters take damage whenever any lightning-type attack is used. Gotcha. Well, we're going to hit you with a melee attack, and then we're going to hit you with... Sonic Boom. Ooh. I didn't know Wingloom was that defensive. Metal conducts electricity, increasing the scope and range of lightning type attacks. Yes. I'll be honest. That was so much damage. That's such a lethal combination. Okay, let's see if we can hopefully take it down this turn. Should be able to. Yeah. Let that be the end of it. Okay. Existence is suffering. <laughs> okay, let's heal up the party. Yep, that's looking better. I love how effective sort of type strengths and weaknesses can be in this game. Because unlike Pokemon, you don't get a flat damage increase or decrease, but the buffs and the debuffs, they can get so strong. You will go no farther until you repent for your shins. I'm sorry for having shins. Okay, a Mask of Rattle may have Revenge Strike, so I'm going to avoid using physical attacks. Okay, lovely. This should be the end. Okay, that one's down. Spit all over the naughty cultist. Yorman Gold. It had preemptive attack. Is this like a third evolved form of um, Masqueratel? We need to evolve ours. Okay, same thing as last time, except with Sonic Boom for a bit of extra damage. Ooh, this thing is fast. Okay, you only had two. Brick Blast hits each member multiple times. Nice, so that's like four hits. Wait, it's meant to be repent for your sins? I can't believe I had it wrong all this time. I'm going to be obsessively saving now, because that crash is something I would like to avoid at all costs. Okay, so there's a beach area just here to the north with a cave, and Autumn Hill seems to extend northward. Oh, well I suppose it would actually be eastward. Yes, because we are currently facing east. Ooh, there's something here. Something I probably can't reach. No. Okay, that's a bit of mystery to solve later when I've got some more powers. And a double battle. Our faith can move mountains. Cooper, 1720. Okay, what have you got? Skelevangelist. Nice. Okay, we're going to wallop the Thwackalope first. Good first round. We're going to wallop the Skelevangelist and we're going to use Sonic Boom. How are we looking? Uh... Oh, good stuff. Greater love has no one than this. To lay down one's tapes for one's friends. Dorian, 1513. Yes, this Dorian character, he seems... Well, he seems like a cult leader, which which makes sense. Okay, camera perspective has shifted back to normal. Do I need to heal before this fight? No, it'll be fine. A trifix. Well, judging by the similar colour palette, I imagine that is an evolved Allseer. Ooh. Okay, that was good damage. Oh, that took down my AP, you absolute bugger. 
Let's see if this can end the fight. Well, with the Trifix at least. Yes. Nope, sadly, Tokyo Sect could not handle that. Let's grab Burnus out. Okay, we're going to go for Cole's story and we're going to go for another Sonic Boom. Oh, he has another. I just absolutely ruined him. Okay, this is the first instance of this happening, where one of my monsters has actually taken the opponent's, the human opponent's health all the way down to zero. If he had another monster to send my way, did I just circumvent that by taking him down to zero? Because if I did, that would be a great strategy. The Intergalactic Council of UFOs and Archangels won't stand for such mistreatment of their messengers. Oh, I don't like that. Okay, let's use a respool on Tokisect, put him back in the fight, and a rewind on Decibel. Oh, that's the rocket. That's the... Oh, Bulletino. I think this is the one that gives us a new ability. They're both fire type, so what we're going to do, we're going to wallop this one, and we're going to spit on it as well. It's fast, dude. It's really fast. Okay. It's... yeah. Oh no, I think I'm gonna kill it. No! Right. I need to find another one. Okie dokie. What we're going to do... I'm gonna use Wallop with the first guy, and I'm going to use toaster tape to record him. Because this will have a better chance with fire enemies, yes. So this should put us up to 100%. Yep. Excellent. Right. That's amazing. 200 speed! So this thing will always go first, basically. Oh, if I want to set a condition to an enemy or on the battlefield or something, this is the one I want to do it with. My dash just got increased. Yes. Okay. So. Oh, that is fast. Grab the contents of this. Aerosol tape. Okay, that's for air types. Let's get some solid ground and... Oh, wow. Okay. Yep. Yeah. That is so fast. You're down. Yes, you're finished. Getting tons of resources. I'm, I'm pretty pleased with this. They're called the Morn Children. Oh, you only joined for the food. Bless you. I hope there's a campfire in the next square because I kind of need one. Someone's asleep down there. I'm going to go and dash into them at some point. Right, we need to activate a bridge. That thing is so quick. Okay, keep your eyes peeled for some sort of switch. Okay, I'm going to use one more healing item just in case this gets rough. Oh. Okay, that actually worked out way better. Let's talk to this person. Ooh, this is Zed. <laughs> What's that? Sleeping? No, not at all. I was uh, meditating. I'm Zed. That said, it's getting real difficult to meditate around here. What with all these Bulletinos zooming around? Any chance you could sort that out for me? Defeat five Bulletinos. Yeah, that shouldn't be an issue, because they're quite easy to destroy. However, I do take damage every time one of them dies, so... Metal types can be melted with fire-type attacks, which causes lasting damage to the target. Yeah. Nice. This is a good excuse to get our resources up, too. Velocir Rifle. Recording. Ooh, 9%'s not great. But that was a hell of a hit. Okay, up to 54. Could be worse. Yeah, we got him. Okay, so for stats, we've got 140 ranged attack and 160 speed. That's actually really nice. 
Ricochet is a passive. This uses ranged attacks of a 50% chance to ignore opponent's walls. That I like. Coupled with multi-shot means if anyone's got a wall up, I can still deal damage. A Jormungold. There's one in the wild. I love that preemptive strike. Okay, so this is how we're going to play this. We are going to wallop the Bulletino. We are going to dodge with Kaylee. Record it with the chrome tape because it's better than the basic tape. Recording. 41's looking good. It's going to take a hit. Oh, okay. Yeah, brilliant. And it didn't hit Kaylee, which means it's guaranteed. Got it. Ooh, look at those stats. 190 speed. This will be amazing on the team. It's got a hell of a lot of moves too. Automatically hits an opponent, which is amazing. Revenge Strike is a passive. I like Multi Smack. It's got Bite. And all it needs is Toxic Stab, and this thing's perfect. And yes, that will be our quest complete. Thanks for that. Man, it shouldn't be this hard for a Ranger Captain to get a bit of Shut Eye. Right. Yes, Kaylee, that is exactly the reaction you should be having. You knew he was a ranger captain. Kaylee, you're useless. Well, I am, but I need to heal first. No, of course I'm not. Look at that dash. That is so good. And it's only going to get stronger when we beat Archangels. Lovely jubbly. That's everyone healed. Ooh. I know what we're going to do, actually. Yes. We're going to spend some of those fused materials that we've got. Okay, we're going to buy one of these. That will allow us to carry an extra healing item, but I also want to get this. Fusion meter and, yes, this. Extra chance to record. This is also piquing my curiosity. The rangers will provide additional ingredients to Clemence at the Gramophone Cafe, allowing her to stop one additional kinds of coffee. So I'm gonna buy that. Thank you, Wilma. Because I've only been able to buy one kind of coffee so far. Okay, we'll grab the rest of those that we can buy. We'll grab one of these. Americano to go. This gives us four additional AP. This is so good. That's so much more useful. Because this will allow us to use much more powerful moves. Cool. Actually, no, we need tapes. We need tapes. There isn't really a limit on how many of those we can buy. I might grab a couple of chromes as well. Let's grab three. Okay, hello Zed. How much would you bet that this fight is going to be all about sleep? Okay. Ooh, okay. Characters with intercepting intercept all attacks directed at their allies. Well, then I'll just hit you with all of my attacks. Salamagus looks amazing, by the way. Uh, let's use dodge on Kaylee. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, this thing... This thing's so defensive. It's got a ton of defense and a ton of HP. It's really bad at attacking though, so let's berserk it, and then let's use Sonic Boom, because this should hit it twice. Ooh, it still hit the Salamagus, even though it's got intercepting. AP drain sucks, man. Okay, let's continue to wallop, and we'll will not use another Sonic Boom because I don't have enough AP. Let's use Call for Help. Oh, it failed. AP Drain is the worst thing in the world. Do I switch at this point into something that's not AP Drained? I could go into Burnus. Actually, yes, because they really don't like poison or plastic, do they? No, let's use a Spit. Oh, the AP Drain applies to me and not the monster, so I can't switch out of debuffs. Cheeky. I can use Sonic Boom now, however. That is good news. That Salamagus is taking major damage. Ooh, burned. Right. That is A-OK, -okay because this is going to hit them like a truck, and I will spit on Zed. Yes. Okay, we're going to smack Zed, and we're going to use a Sonic Boom, and this should end the fight, I think. 
Oh, maybe not. Zed, Zed will stay up. But Salamagus, off he go. Oh. oh. <laughs> How's the fight going? Have I won yet? Ooh, hello. What on earth are you? You're Astral, so I'm going to hit you with a poison attack first, and I'm going to use Spit. It's poisoned, so it's going to take damage every turn anyway. It's It's got some HP, this thing. Let's give it another debuff. Hopefully it's going to be defense down, and we'll do another Spit. Speed down. That's useless because it's got no speed anyway. Yeah, Malcomy's going down before the end of this fight. Well, that's A-OK. -okay. We're going to use Bomb Bomb Blast. Hopefully it hits. Go on, do your damage. Ooh, that was good damage. And we're through. I'm tired. Amazing. Echolocation. Used automatically at the start of the battle for zero AP. Gives the user multi-target status for three turns. I like that. And yes, Tokusect gains Sonic Boom. However, it's ranged, and Tokusect prefers melee. Decent chunk of items. Wow. Here's my reward. There's another captain that I've missed. I need to find that captain, because I just beat number three before I beat number two. Guarantees the target's next move won't miss. I don't really have any moves that are super inaccurate. Unless, I wonder if that works with sleep. So for example, if I use this move and my ally puts me to sleep, would those 1% accuracy sleep moves that are like 120 power, would they guarantee to hit? Because if they do, and if I've somehow got multi-target, ooh, I'm liking the sound of that. A strange olive-flavoured soft drink that instantly levels up one character. We've got a rare candy. Thank you, Zed. Thank you very much. Okay, cross over the bridge, and let's see what we've got up here. Now the cultist over this direction. Beat me, and I'll tell you the secret of the Morn Child. And I win. In 1988, two English rock bands, Iron Gaiden and Shields of the Nephilim, without knowledge of each other, simultaneously released songs titled Morn Child. If you listen to them in reverse, and at the same time so that the words interweave, it summons the original Morn Child, a being so powerful that it can open a gateway between worlds. Also I've heard, neither track is available here in New World, so I've got no way to tell if I'm having my leg pulled. Brother Cooper has found a different way out of New World anyway, that's for sure. Is it? I feel like that's probably not for sure. There's a rogue fusion. I'm gonna have to do it. I'm gonna have to do it. Ooh. This looks like a Bulletino and a Squirey. That would be my guess. Okay, Fusion goes down. They're going to be flinched, and now I can hit them both because Kaylee has multi-target enabled. Yes. And we win. 820 experience points. Snoopin has gained a rank. Weaverlite has gained a rank. And Brick Blast, which we like, Fuse Material, and some extras. Yes, please. Okay, we're not actually wanting to be down here just yet, so let's head back up, and let's heal. May as well heal the Malcomy as well, just in case we need that in a future fight. Ooh. Hello. What are you? Massively reduces incoming plant type damage by 50% and negates any reactions that would occur. Does not affect critical hits. I mean, the fact that it's passive and halves plant damage and negates reactions, that is really strong. That is a great find. I haven't done a whole lot of sticker building quite yet, and that's because I've been waiting to build up a stock of them to be able to really choose precisely what I want. I will do it. Just not quite yet. Brick Blast and a Chrome Tape. That is brilliant. Hopefully if I hit this switch... Does that stay on forever? I hope so. Because that would be my way up after I defeat the Land Keepers Association. I'm going to drop a save just because this game does crash. I'm going to jump onto the roof. 
Let's go in and have another fight. Hey. Oh, they're only level 14. This is not going to be too difficult, I don't think. We're going to wallop and we're going to spit. And it hits both. That is beautiful. Ooh, a hop skin. Okay, we're going to hit you and we're going to Sonic Boom. That is just beautiful. And a snoop in. That's fine. Same thing applies. We're just going to take you down. Eugene will be pleased because we win. Ooh, there's a fused material in this. Oh, was there loot that I didn't collect in the last one? I need to go and check because those things are very, very valuable. Thank you very much, game. Do appreciate it. And we jump straight back up. Hello, Masquerattle. Yes, I want you. Got it. Okay, bootleg. What do we have? Ooh, okay, so I can increase its chance to happen per every empty slot, and it destroys walls. Multi-smack has extra damage. It's not too bad, you know. That is better than my current Masquerattle, so that's the one that I'm going to raise. Absolutely wonderful. I always wanted to join an evil cult, now I finally can. Rule number one of being in an evil cult, you never admit to being in an evil cult. It's only a thwackalope, we got this. Ooh, this one's got a second. A Kitelli? Or a Kitelli? I like Kitelli. Hopefully I can find one of those. Okay, Burnus. One, it's level five, which means it can now evolve. And two, it's got self-destruct. Which isn't that good, is it? Because I don't want it to hurt my ally. If I'm getting beaten, if I'm getting hurt by an enemy, it means the enemy's strong and I need help. Very glad to see this campfire. If I'm being beaten and my monsters are dying, then realistically the last thing that I want is to add more damage to my team. However, I will only be hitting one team member, but I'll be hitting everything on the other side with 60 power, so that's not nothing. Okay, Burnus. Yes, I want to evolve. Oh, that defense is gnarly. Smogmagog. There's a joke in there somewhere, but I'm not going to say it. Lovely. So this presumably is the, the settlement coming up here. I'm curious, very, very curious about this altar looking thing. Okay, so there's nothing to actually interact with yet. Okay, we're going to leave that for now and we'll come back to it later. Hello, cultist. Are you going to attack me the second I speak to you? Yes, I think you are. Go easy on me. I'm still new to this. No. We've got an all seer, which means we're going to wallop it, and we're going to spit in its face. Okay, a basic smack will do here, but I am going to use Sonic Boom just in case I can take out, yes, the cultist. See you later, even if you add another one, you are not bringing it out. Nice. We love that. Ethereal tape. That's for astral type monsters. And we got a bite sticker. Hello. Oh, brilliant. We've got a fast travel point here. That is exactly what I wanted to see. Greetings. I'm here to speak to Dorian. <laughs> Miss Kaylee, welcome back. Come, come. You're just in time. For what? I feel like something is happening. This is a little bit eerie. And everyone wants to fight. Brilliant. Wait, is that you, Kaylee? You're a deserter. Okay, it shouldn't be too much of a problem here. But there we go. Yep, that's the end of the fight. Okay, well, let's check out the houses first while they're here. Did that barrel just move? I feel like the game just... What happened? This flying saucer creature will emerge from its shell if given the ability to remain close to its opponents. Okay, what's in this one? Oh, fight. 
I feel like there's going to be a horrible boss fight at the end of all this. Ooh, a Salamagus. Okay, well, we're just going to do standard attacks. This thing's not lasted long. Ooh, a Pyromelian. I like the sound of that. That looks so cool. It's not going to last long, though. No. Oh. <laughs> oh, right. There's a bridge that needs to be... Yeah, okay. And if you look here, yes, there is a switch on top of this house, which means I need to get all the way around. Oh, there's a button in there. I would like to... I would like to do something with said button. Okay. That opens the way to the button. That raises the bridge, which takes us to the top level. Across the bridge. Morningtown Key. Moonshine, so it's astral and inflicts confuse. And a faux fur tape, which... Ah, okay, that's for beast-type monsters. So this will allow us to get through this gate, yes. We can come around here to come and grab this switch. Which opens that button, which does precisely what exactly? Ah, okay. Allows us to move ahead. I think we've cleared most of the content in this area, so let's drop a save. Do I bother using a rewind now? Yeah, go on. It's half health. It's not nothing. May we have quiet in the audience. Who is she? Is she my replacement? Creepy. Dorian will now speak. Wait, she looks like Kaylee, doesn't she? Who is this guy? Okay. Man, what a great crowd you always are. Listen, guys, Mourn Child or whatever, you've all been doing such a great job with the digging. I mean, seriously, this is a primo quality hole. The pit is as deep as your devotion to the cause. It's like a metaphor. What are they excavating? When I first heard the whispers in my head guiding me beneath the earth, I knew I couldn't do this alone. And sure, we've had ups and downs. But we've done it. Pull the curtain. Okay, is this another Archangel? Soon I will enter the chamber and bargain with him for a share of his divine power. And to accompany me, our prodigal daughter returns to us. Oh no. Isn't that right, Kaylee? Oh no. Oh no, indeed. Kaylee, honey. Kaylee, honey, you look like a deer in headlights. Of course I got word you were joining us for our big party. Didn't you tell your friend here that you helped us run this place alongside me? No, she did not. I understand why, but she didn't. Sorry. I'll explain later. We need to put a stop to this for now. <laughs> you didn't believe in me, did you? Well, it looks like I was right all along, baby. There's a real damn Archangel right under our feet. We fought Archangels, Dorian. If you go in there, you'll get yourself killed. If you and your friend have so much experience, why not come and join in the fun? Watch me ascend to godhood with my new Archangel buddy. Dorian, Dorian, Dorian. I don't think your relationship with the Archangel is precisely what you expect it is. Jacqueline? The platform, if you please. Yes. See ya. Let's go and stop this idiot from whatever he thinks he's doing. Where did everyone go? Literally every person. Let's have a look around here first, just to make sure we're not missing out on any loot or anything else. There's a house. Ooh, money. There is no currency in New World. Where did the money come from? Does he really have a way out of New Wirral? I mean, it would, it would seem so, because who paid him? Oh, this just got interesting. Yep, this is a familiar sight. We'll go ahead first, and if they aren't instantly killed by the Archangel, I'll go in and do my sweet talking. You absolute horror. Whoa, this one looks really different from the last two. This is really colourful. Another Archangel, it's as painful to look at as the others. Have you heard my call? Are you here to pay tribute? Are you here to burn for me? Here goes nothing. 
O oh, great Archangel, I have heeded your call and travelled to your abode. Oh. Right. I didn't get to read that text because it just sort of disappeared. You do not take from me, you only give. Dorian is either a puddle or a pile of ash. I can't really tell which with this art style, but either way, I don't think a rest is going to cut it. Morning Star. The Serpent God. It's got preemptive strike. You're a nasty piece of work. Okay, let's start with a wallop, and we shall start with a dodge from Kaylee. Damage is okay. Yeah, that sucks. Um, let's use taunt. Right, I'm. I don't have a whole lot of options here, to be honest. Ooh, let's use call for help. More action economy, or rather, more hits coming from my side, and someone else to hit would be amazing. That's not good. No. Temptation. Oh, I don't like that. Um, okay, let's chuck out Malcomy. How do we want to play this? I'm going to play Elemental Wall, just so I can avoid some damage. Kaylee is dodging, so that's fine. If I use Sonic Boom, am I going to hit that tree, and is that tree going to do horrible things to me? I don't know the answer, but I want to. Ah. Oh no. Oh, Kaylee, no. No effect, thank goodness. Took no damage, that's nice. Broadcast. Oh, it's multi-target now, that's bad. And I will use dodge again. Characters with shrapnel take damage each time they transform. Okay. Judgment. Well, in theory, Sire takes no damage. Kaylee took a bit. Let's use Trick again. And now I'll start using Sonic Boom. Yeah, need to get some damage on this guy. Conductive. Ooh, that's good. He's going to hurt himself if he uses Thunder Strikes. Okay. AP Drain, not nice. I want to hit you with a Poison move, because hopefully that will give you some pretty nasty poison damage. So I just want to do a bit of damage. Please hit. Good. Status blocked. Ah, you're going to damage yourself now, because you're also conductive, yes. Neutralize. Do not get rid of your debuffs. You horrible bugger. Okay, we're going to use another trick, and we're going to use air wall. AP down. Shoot at star right. Sire is down. Okay, let's go with Snoopin. If I can make it flinch, it's going to miss its turn to use its thingy. And we're just going to spit. No effect. Okay, so, right. Got it. So the... Um, come on, brain. The tree tanks a hit for it. Uh, okay, let's send out the traffic guy. Right, we kind of want this to be the flinch, don't we? If we get the flinch, then we survive this turn. Okay, we're going to use multi-smack. It's low damage. Oh, it's got revenge strike. It's flinching. Excellent. Okay, we've avoided that attack for now. We're going to hit it with a bite, just because, yeah, we're going to die next turn anyway, and I'd like to get some good damage on it. Um, let's use Inflame, because it's ranged and it's fire, and hopefully we can burn it. Nope. That was a good chunk of damage, though. Oof. Yeah, that hits like a truck. Oh, Sire's, like, properly down. Due to plastic's insulating nature, lightning-type attacks on plastic-type targets leave an electric charge behind, which the target can use to give an extra shock to its opponents. Excellent. Hopefully, I mean, if I could burn it, I can maybe heal myself. No. I feel like this is it. I'm going to give myself a heal, 
and then I'm going to switch. Ooh. No, we're going to use Brick Blast. Please, please. Okay, that's gone. Oh, we healed a bit. That's nice. Right, one more bit of damage. If we can live, if we can do this, this will be amazing. Let's go for Inflame. Is he down? Yes! Ah, oh, an upgrade, fused material, and a bunch of rewards. That was a good fight. I liked that. Your stamina increased by 14%. You can now glide for four seconds. If you wish to leave this land, then heed my words and hear my song. You must rise to the task at hand, you must walk the path most long. To the east your wings must fly, to the place only I have known. For that is where my chambers lie, halls now empty and alone. The rest of the song is too quiet to make out. Dear Sky again. Morning Star, is that right? Boy, do I have a job opportunity for you. Some humans got in here. Run along now, will you? Oh, who is that person? Dorian. Why does Jacqueline look so much like Kaylee? Sorry. I'm sorry, but it's his own fault. Yeah, it was. We should all leave. The air tastes like death. Commune. We'll open its gates. We will try to find common ground with the rest of New Wirral. Nice. The people of this community are not bad people. You just have to be wary of those you put your faith into. Lost people look for guidance, and that's what Dorian offered them. We're another Archangel down, and I'm going to help you find the rest. Yes! Quest complete. Ooh! <gasps> nice! You can now use fusion power when fused with Kaylee. Fusions you form with Kaylee now have plus 10% added strength. Nice. Another Archangel battle that ended with an appearance from the Triangle Man. Yeah, I'm feeling the same thing, Kaylee. I think he's going to show up for every single one, probably. What was the next line in the song? But that is where my chambers lie. Hall's now empty and alone. Let's crack on. Where are we off to next? Didn't you hear some rumours about something happening in Eastern Woods? We could see what's happening there. That fight was really fun. I really enjoyed that. And again, I won by the skin of my teeth. Despite being overleveled, that was not an easy fight. My tactics aren't great, I do know that, I need to get better, and I think what I'm probably going to do to address that is I'm going to really look at the sticker combinations that my monsters have. I think it's about time that I really focus on what strategies I'm using. But that is a next time thing, because that is more than enough for now. I hope you've enjoyed this episode, I've enjoyed playing it, I will catch you on the next one. 24 of you... Wait. Oh no! During my interrogation of this poor chatbot, I actually came up with an idea. What if I asked ChatGPT how I should market my video? Immediately, the stack disappeared. Oh!